Moving up and down in weight takes a lot out of a fighter. Is this something you can keep doing? And how has it been coming back to <coughs> super middleweight? Um, I feel I feel my best in 168. That's, that's, that's what I feel my best. Was it hard cutting no, back? No, not that hard. So well, it's, it's hard, but I can do it. So um, this rivalry with Golovkin has been so much a part of your career. Uh, I guess what emotions are going through you now that you're you're close to closing the chapter completely uh, on, on this part of your career? Um, I'm I'm so excited to get back in the ring, and, and I'm more with Golovkin. All the things happen around, so I'm excited. Are you glad there's no Abel around the, the trash pot? No, no. Did you, you like know, that I, I don't I don't I don't get any Abel scientists or all the training. I don't care. At the end of the day, it's Golovkin and I. We have two more minutes and we're done. Canelo, Eddie, Canelo, Canelo, when you think about... So two questions there. First one was, what kind of Gennady Golovkin do you expect? Do you expect an aggressive Gennady Golovkin or one that comes in kind of tactically to box? And the other answer was, I really don't know. You know, I don't know if he's going to come aggressively or he's going to come to box. But we prepared for both styles and be able to come back whatever style he comes. Eddie, por favor, puedes definir a este Canelo. Este Canelo que pareciera una fiera herida. Tú como entrenador, ¿cómo sientes este Canelo? Que se ve eh, como una baja para rasurar, pero oh, tú como definas. Bien demotivado y este, con ganas de que ya sea el sábado. So the question was, how are you to Eddie Ransom? How do you how do you see Sal at the moment? Is he kind of sharp? Is he is he is he in great shape? But how do you see him? And uh, Eddie's answer was, I see him really motivated and looking forward to going in the ring. You know, with you know, with lots of willingness to get in that ring. I guess for three of you, you know, who and we can go on Sal, Eddie, and Chapo. Who else is out there that you feel can give you such a great rivalry? Like, how Golovkin's giving you? Like, who else is out there that can give you three great fights? I don't know. That's that's hard to, to say because you never know. And maybe you think uh, one fighter is it, it not, right? Eddie, who más queda donde tú pienses que puede dar a un rival que puede dar tres gran peleas a Saúl como a Golovkin? No te entendí, la verdad. ¿Qué qué sí qué 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 otro qué otro peleador piensas que podemos Conmigo. ¿Se puede hacer otra tecnología? Sí. Pues hay varios, primero hay que hacer esta, ¿verdad? Pero hay, hay varios por ahí que se pueden hacer buenas peleas. Pero primero hay que hacer la, la primera. Hay que ver tres, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. so hay first, muchos, hay muchos donde se pueden hacer buenas peleas. So the various that can, you know, can give great fights, important great fights, but first we need to take care of this one, you know, but there are, there are many out there. Canela, thank when, you guys when, for when you coming and we need to clear the room now. Thank you so much for coming. Canela, when you think about all the trilogies, there was a lot of hate in there, but at the end of the day, these guys came together yeah, and became like almost friends, like Ferreira and Morales. Do you think that'll ever happen? We'll see, we'll see. Yeah, because that's, that's what I think. The, the, uh, after the, the second fight, he started talking to all the I'm, I'm, I'm good with that. Big respect though between both of you, right? Yeah. Like you respect him as a fighter. Thank you for your time. He's a good fighter.